Uh, Chosin's getting ready to deploy to the 7th Fleet in Western Pacific. And um, uh, We're going to be doing some theater security cooperation ops. Uh, we'll be working with other countries in the region and supporting the 7th Fleet's mission. And uh, uh, We're feeling pretty excited. It's been a long time. It's been over two years since Chosin last deployed. Um, so we're ready to finally go execute Chosin's mission. And I personally hope uh, that all of the sailors get a chance to do their jobs, to gain some pride in the ship that they've worked so hard to get ready for this deployment. Okay, and uh, it feels uh, you know, pretty hard, but we like to say thank you to all of our friends and families. Without your love and support, we wouldn't be able to go do what we're off to do. I'm sure that there are some people that are uh, sad, I guess in a way, kind of disappointed to be leaving, don't want to leave their family. I'm one of those, but there are some people that are actually pretty excited. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Not very many people can say that they've done this. And, uh... Uh, I know a lot of people about to say bye to their families. It's going to be real hard, I'm, I'm sure. Um, but. Yeah, getting ready to go on deployment, so pretty excited, kind of nervous, but doing a good thing for this country, so. Did you get a chance to, uh... Yeah, I have a lot of mixed emotions, you know, I'm very proud of him, um, and everybody else that's on the ship, but, you know, it's hard, you know, with the kids without their dad, and me without my husband. And, um... I would just like to say, you know, um, I love my husband, you know, tell my husband I love you and to the rest of the guys that's on the ship, you know, I'm very proud that, you know, and I don't, I don't know, I just, it's, it's just a lot of mixed emotions and what I would say to the guys on the ship is just, just keep their heads up, you know. I know it's hard, but it, it's hard on the families too.